Waiji ka khalsa, waiji ka fate. My friends, I'm very pleased to be here today in order to thank many of you for the support that you gave me only, uh, only last month. And I only wish I could have shared a few of those votes with that great candidate who we had down in Gravesham, Tanmajit, and I hope that he's going to actually play a future in the House of Commons at a future, from a future election. I'm also pleased to be here today on the platform together with Councillor Preet Gill from Samwell Borough Council, what an inspiring speech she gave, and my long-standing colleague from the neighbouring constituency, Tom Watson, who's been a great campaigner on behalf of the community and will also be a great deputy leader of our, part, of our party. And I just want to congratulate the organisers here today. I know everybody, whether, whatever sort of event it is, they turn up and think it all happens by magic. And it's the work that the organisers do that enable these sort of events to take place. And I'd like to thank them and congratulate them here today. But I also think we have to ask the question, why are we here today? We you know it's a beautiful day. Why are we not out uh, celebrating with our, uh, our families in, a, in, in the garden, enjoying the sunshine, enjoying also the success that the community has had here in this great country of ours and the contribution that they've made? So why are we here today? Because partly because there are many issues that we still need to address. Tom mentioned the war memorial to those tens of thousands from the Sikh community who came over to Europe to stop the aggression of Germany at that, at that time. And many of those left their bones there in Flanders and in, and, and in France. We're here today because there are still the issues of the inability to wear the Sikh articles of faith in so many countries and the duty and the obligation on the British government in order to represent in Europe those interests and to make sure that that, that voice is heard. And also to make sure that the issues that concern the Sikh community in this country are addressed as well. And many of those were outlined in the excellent Sikh manifesto published before the, before the election. But why are we here in June? And that's very clear from many of the posters and the placards here today. <clears throat> We're here because 31 years ago, the Sikh nation suffered that appalling assault in Operation Blue Star, and also the events that followed after of the massacres and the tortures and the disappearances that took place, and the pain of that and the grief of that and the suffering of that is still felt today. We're here today because still some of those who finish their sentences, irrespective of the justice of those sentences, they're still being held in prison in India, even though their sentences have, have expired. We're here today because, as Tom rightly said, the community, the Sikh nation across the world still demands truth and justice and freedom and we're here to show solidarity with that demand. Thank you for inviting me here today, and thank you for turning up today as well.